Hey guys, it's Ta. Welcome back. So, today I have for you guys kind of a Dollar Tree haul, kind of more like a craft store situation. Um, so, the other day, well, I've been cleaning my craft room, trying to redo it so I can set it up better in there. But I was, I come across a situation where I have a ton of stickers that are literally thrown into one of those plastic organizers you know with the three big drawers some people use it for additional clothes storage you know the big wide ones and it just every time I needed something out of it it took me forever to find it so I asked some people um, what how they store their stickers and stuff and I got to brainstorming and I think I figured out a solution so that's one reason I went to Dollar Tree but then it's Dollar Tree, so we just like Dollar Tree. And I'm trying to do this whole self-quarantine thing, but I have to get out at least once every other day. Because if not, I'm, dr I'm going to drive myself insane. So, that's what I did today. Alright, so I have this. This is a bag from 31. This is nothing but stickers. Holiday stickers. Um random Dollar Tree collections, pearl dot thingies, you know, flatbacks, just you name it, it's in here. Stickers that some of you guys have sent me uh, with cards and whatnot. It's just tons of stickers. So, my solution was this. I had a binder. So I grabbed said binder and then I had I had, thought I had a whole pack, but apparently I lost it. These manila, um, like the folders. So what I did was I punched holes in the folder. And it kind of sticks out, but it's okay. And I'm going to label it with whatever stickers are inside. So if I need Christmas, I can go find the one that says Christmas. I can pull it out, dump it out, and find what I need. That way, I have some sort of organization. So... That's what I'm figuring out with that. So I went to Dollar Tree to make this possible. I needed a hole puncher, so I just got one of the little binder ones. Uh, I had a really nice one. I can't put my hands on it. I got it at Dollar General, I want to say sometime last year, for like four bucks, or maybe even less than that. It's one of the really nice ones, like the metal ones. I can't find it. <clears throat> so anyway, Went to Dollar Tree, grabbed some more of those. They only have the ones that have the, um, like, sticker. I don't want to stick them, so I might add a piece of Velcro to these. That way I can seal them without, like, completely sealing them, you know. I can get into them as needed. And then I also got some small ones. These have the clasp. Uh, I have a couple giveaway, not giveaway, a couple, um challenges that need to be mailed out here soon and some of them are small enough to fit in these so I got those and that's pretty much what I needed um everything else you're about to see is because I wanted it all right so I found the crafter's choice large glue sticks I got two packs of those sorry um because sometimes those small ones just it's not enough glue so I just pick these up for whenever I have those projects where I just need a steady flow of glue and then I saw these hanging up <clears throat> I'm thinking these are like the new colors or whatever it is paper clips pink screens purples a darker purple and then the matching rubber bands you get 50 of these you get 250 of these they also had binder clips, but I was not in need of binder clips. And then the rest of this could have stayed there, but I just couldn't leave it. Because I'm already doing sticker organization, so why not get these stickers too? This is all new stuff to me. Um, the cashier had even said she 
had just put some of these out, which is super awesome. So I went ahead and got all of them in every color. All right, so I got these. These were by Jot. You get 12 of them as the colorful flowers. Then you have the blue shades, the white shades, and then the white butterflies with a little pearl in the middle, and the blue shade of butterflies. I didn't see any butterflies in the multicolored, so either they didn't make those or they're just out at my store. And then I found this. It is travel themed stickers. And they're glittery. And then I found these. These are food related. And then these are also food related. And the one at the bottom says, enjoy this sweet moment. And keep the food theme going. Um, it's kitchen, more or less. Baking. And then we have this one. It is No Drama Llama. It's llamas and cacti. And these were really cute. Um, it's kind of like banners. I guess you can add words and stuff to these if you want it to. Because they leave space in the middle. And then these are like actual banners. So you could probably write on them or put stickers. Like if you have small ones to spell something out. These are... Um, I don't know. I thought they were birthday kind of related at first. But no. They're still really cute. You have this cute bicycle feeling lucky some I love you balloons and then it says get a fresh start live life in full bloom choose happy do what you love enjoy today dream it wish it do it and then this one is mason jars flowers butterflies And like I said, these are all new to me. I had never seen those in there. And then these are the really cute ones. And I got one in every color they had on the shelf. And that's two, three, four, five, six different colors. They are nine to a pack. And it's butterflies. And I don't know if you guys can kind of see, they pop up. They're not flat stickers. They pop up. So there's green. And then this yellow kind of orange brown theme. Very shimmery, shiny. And then a orange theme. A pink theme. A blue theme theme and a purple theme so I thought these were really cute I absolutely love them um, now it's going to be let's use them and not hoard them because you know sometimes you get something and you're like well I can only find so many of them and they're amazing and you just don't want to use them right away but I'm going to try to use these like really put an effort to use all of the new stickers I got but yeah so main reason I went to Dollar Tree was the envelopes and the hole puncher so that I can get these stickers organized and I really wasn't supposed to buy more stickers but we see how that went um so yeah that is what I'm about to work on is popping holes labeling these envelopes um attaching velcro so I can open them easy and getting the stickers inside so hopefully i can get that done and then that'll be one less thing to worry about in the craft room and i have one corner left to go through and then i have to find a table 
I had one um, that was supposed to be given to me, but it got given to someone else for something else instead. But it is what it is. Um, I can find one easy enough, I guess. But that's it. That way I can craft in there, in the actual craft room, instead of the kitchen table. Because when I'm just taking a break from a project, you gotta leave everything there. And then somebody wants to eat, well then you gotta move stuff. <sighs> anyway, so that is the plan. And yeah, that's about it. So I will let you guys go with that. Um, down below how do you store your stickers do you think this is going to be um a good solution for me or do you have something better because like i said i only spent a dollar for the you know each pack of the manilas and you can use those um for other stuff like mailing and whatnot so i can always use that for something else if you guys have a different solution because that's about all I got right now. Been pondering on this for a few days. And that is what I came up with last night. So, yeah. I will let you guys go. And I will see you next time. Bye.